let us know in the comments below how you guys are doing. Uh, soy muy bien. You too? Muy bien. <laughs> Alright. And today we are heading to the Mercado, which we are super excited about because we love the yes. energy that is in the Mercados and we love the food. Yeah. Uh, gonna get some nice veggies, best place to get them. And we're gonna take you along with us. As you saw yesterday, we walked around the city of Oaxaca and it's just beautiful, guys. We love this city. It's full of art, just beauty everywhere. The people are super kind and we love Oaxaca. Uh, let us know if you have been to Oaxaca in the comments below and don't forget to like and stay tuned. guys so now we are in the Mercado 20 de Novembre which is the 20th of November and we sat down at a restaurant it is called Comedor Typical <laughs> so um, we watched the YouTube video of a guy coming here and he got chocolate de agua and he also got um, this big mass of like, tortilla a whole bunch of stuff on it so of course I had to get that and Brittany got a mole with like a chicken thigh I can't believe I just did that. <laughs> I can't either. It was so good though, honestly. Like, first bite I took, I was like, oh, I'm finishing this because it's so good. I'm not wasting any of it. It was like, it was better than I thought for sure. It's got really good flavor. It was like a Mexican pizza. Muy rico. Oh my gosh guys this is a little hidden gem we heard about it from our local friend shout out to you Lewis you made our trip amazing and without you we wouldn't have found this place and that would have been very sad because the breakfast here was to die for
place is a very very romantic more of a fancy dinner we tried like a tasting platter to try kind of everything and oh my gosh guys super super tasty you gotta check it out Bulenke cafe this time we uh, dined in for some lunch and I gotta tell you guys, this this place is, the food's awesome and just the interior design here is just beautiful. The, the sandwich I had, like editing this video, I remember the taste and what I would do to have another bite of that sandwich. So good. Our second night there, we had some pizza, some wood-fired pizza, and it was just to die for. <laughs> Honestly, guys, try the pizza if you're going here. Really romantic at nighttime. This one is another really romantic dinner, and again, we tried the tasting platter just to try everything because you gotta try everything in Oaxaca City uh, or Oaxaca in general. The food is uh, definitely the best in all of Mexico. So chocolate de agua, really good. And uh, the Oaxaca cheese, super good. Last but definitely not least was the organic market. Oh my gosh, guys, what a vibe. We found this near the end, which is sad because we would have went like every day, I feel like. You can try all different types of food vendors and then sit in the middle with everybody. We met some amazing people here. You can get produce and all the organic things that you could even think of. We tried horchata for the first time and we were blown away. You'll see that in a second. Say the burnt marshmallow is accurate? Yeah. Uh, I got like a vanilla kind of taste to it. Yeah. Which I didn't expect. It's amazing. Yeah. And it's like actually more refreshing than I thought. Like it's not, not like a heavy drink at all. It's very light, very water, like watery texture. Yeah. 